gonna take a look at a sneaker. I believe it released overseas already. Uh, I was driving one day and I got the notification from In Clothing that these were available to purchase early. So it is an early release day sneaker. Uh, and In Clothing is a a great site to buy sneakers or they do sell authentic sneakers. So you can't go wrong if you get a pair of sneakers from In. They do raffle off their shoes the majority of the time. And a few times I've actually hit them. In this particular sneaker, you see the box, you already know what it is. You see that cement print that is famous on Jordan Retro 3s. And you have that black Nike branding on here. And take a look at the box. You do have your, uh, your box sticker and also you have that UK sticker as well. And we're gonna read it. It says Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG color tech gray muslin black and white this is a u.s men's 9.5 which is a uk 8.5 open the box top see right here you have your live stamp take a look at the paper your paper is glossy and you have that cement print all over the paper and look down in the box. Let's get that paper out of the way. You do see your green and white YCM sticker. And that is all the goodies we have in the box. So enough with the uh, box. Let's get on with the sneakers. Here we go guys. We have the Air Jordan Retro 1 cement. Uh, this is a playoff of the Air Jordan Retro 3 cement are the 88 and speaking of that they do have a release of those called the reimagine that's coming out on march 11th so uh let me know if you're gonna be going for those and if you need to see what they look like to help make that decision if you want to purchase or not i do have a video that i uh made on this sneaker about three months ago yeah this was before christmas i made this video and also did a comparison with that pair that set the release march 11th and the pair that came out in 2013 so after you watch this video go ahead and check that video out and hopefully it'll help you make a decision which i think you're probably gonna be in the market to buy the retro three red matches now i get into this sneaker it's very plain and simple you got the cement print on your mud guard, your your eye stays, getting going around your uh, overlays, and on your heel, look a little closer. We have that branded correction. You got that uh, wings logo is bubble on right there. You have a black Nike swoosh right here. You have white leather right here on your quarter panel. It's a decent grain of leather. Get to your midsole. You have that muslin color midsole with tech gray at the very bottom which leads to the outsole you have a full tech gray outsole basically it's your regular traditional jaw one outsole nothing changed nothing fancy about it here's a look at the back of the sneaker hope all this cement prints not making you guys dizzy yes they did make a sneaker with all cement print Oh, uh, looking at the medial side of the sneaker coming from your other side, you have that cement print on the overlays, your lace eyelets, and going around your mud guard. And you got that white leather again on your quarter panel with a black swoosh on top. The leather is decent. You have your uh, muslin color midsole with the tech gray at the very bottom. And get to one of my favorite parts of the sneaker, the toe box. There you go, it's a decent grain of leather. It's pretty good actually. Comes factory lace with the black laces. You have a tech gray nylon tongue with a black woven patch that has the Nike Air branding in the muslin colorway. Get a closer look at that. And you see that uh, little message on the back, cotton on the back of the tongue. You got your black out, uh, I'm sorry, your black sock liner. It's kind of smooth. Try to get you guys a look at that sizing tag. Try to get a, a good look as best as possible. Try to move my, my 
hands out of the way. I do have some decent sized hands. How about I just read it to you guys? U.S. size nine and a half production date July 20th of 2022 to September 23rd of 2022. So only about two months of production with these. So they didn't take too long to make these. Not sure what stock numbers are going to be, but probably going to find out closer to the release date on that. It does come stuffed with tissue. They don't really use shoe trees like that anymore. And here is your uh, your insert. Black feels like that nice cotton material. You have Nike Air branding in the tech gray colorway on there. And on the back, it is a Dream Cell insert. And it also comes with another set of laces. Your laces come in the box now. Make sure your laces have this if you're buying these on the resale market. And I checked the market before I made this video as I show you the uh, extra laces. They're all white. You have white additional laces. They are going around 220 plus fees on the resale market. So if you're trying to get these uh me personally, I think you can wait on release day or if you just have to have a pair of these and you don't want to be patient and wait, it's not a bad time to go get it. It's low. I do think this sneaker will have a real uh, low uh, price point in the resale market. And your fit on these true to size, I will not go up or down in these, these fit true to size. So let me know if y'all gonna be copying these when these finally release. And if you ever bought a pair of sneakers from any clothing, you know what that mean right here. You got that. I'm trying to see where did they draw the cement from for this? Because this is this cement and this is my 2013. So the cement looks mad different. So we're going to compare it to the reimagines that's set to come out on March 11th. And I don't know. You guys be the judge. It looks more like the reimagined or the 2013. But that's the end of the video, guys. And like I always tell you, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know where it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack. Signing out.